Good luck on runs. Yo, Theon, how's it going? Yeah, unfortunately, uh, billiards was dreadful, so we're doing this instead because I want to run plats in this for some unknown reason at some point. Probably because there's no billiards. Yo, Misa as well. Sorry, the... Uh, yeah, the stream notif only went out now in Discord. Yeah, I kind of assumed that people wouldn't know that I was live. Yeah, so I went live a little bit late, uh, but Discord was down. So, yeah. Twitter and um, and Blue Sky did get the notice, but obviously Discord was not having it. So Discord didn't get one. Yeah, as long as I don't hit any obstacles on 30 or more, then we're fine. See, like, look at that. Like, that is dreadful, technically. But, like, how else am I supposed to do that? I really need to look at other people's... Um, other people's runs. Okay, can I admit something quickly? For years, I have actually had Discord mobile notifs off. Because I'll, I check Discord daily anyway. So there's no reason for me to have them on. Obviously, when I'm on desktop, they're on. But... I have never had, I've not had mobile push notifications on for a very long time. What have I been doing earlier? Uh, I did plats runs. I got two runs out of billiards. Very bad billiards luck. Um, two four breaks and like ten uh, three breaks. One of them was a 1-2-X, so awful. Um, but, oh, wow, that was close. Okay, nice. Um, and then another one was like a 1-1-X, one, one low 1-1-X, one, one so not great. Uh, just wanted to get a run going. And oh, that was a terrible load time. What is that? Uh, and, yeah, it died in fishing because of terrible RNG there. Yeah, you're not in the Discord and want to notice anyway. Fair enough. Whoa! No, don't do that. Cool. So the main thing with this run is we can play the levels in any order, but we um, we have to play level 30 last or something. I'm fairly sure that's a uh, that's a thing in Tita targets anyway. Otherwise, there is no way I'd be playing 30 last because 30 is the worst one. And the same here. 30 is terrible here as well. Whoa! Okay, well, we didn't hit it with 30, so we're fine. Oh, see, this is... I hate this game so much. This is the only thing stopping me from running the game a lot. This stupid game. Ah! Oh! Come on, hit the thing. Oh my goodness. Go up. Oh. Center. Oh my goodness. You just get stuck in a loop if you don't get it first time. There we go. That was awful. The good thing is, it, once I have splits for this, I can clearly see where I'm making mistakes and where I can improve. And what I should be looking up strats for. It's a very unique game. It's a very, very unique game. Unfortunately, because it's so long and the cutscenes are terrible, you're not seeing that here because we're skipping them. Um, because it's an IL and we don't have to get the medal here. Um, unfortunately... Uh, oh, that almost worked. Yeah, it's a very unique game, but unfortunately the cutscenes are really long and it takes up like 40% of any run. And I'm talking like even, you know, 30 or 40% of uh, of a Platts run. Yeah, it's it's really difficult to control. So I'm having to... If I hold the controller up for this one, I'll show you what I'm doing. So like this is only level 4. And for some reason I have to point at the screen for, the, for that one, even though you don't have to use the pointer at all. So like I'm holding down to go forwards, right? Uh, so then when we get the alert, as long as I'm... As long as I don't hit anything on, on more than 30, then we're fine. 
Nice. That was very close. Um, like, you, you have infinite damage you can take, basically, as long as you're not hitting anything on more than 30, including the goal. You also have to twist it round. So, like, here I'm going to have to twist it like that to finish. So I'm going to have to do that. But the issue with that is that then my controls are, like, tilted to the left. So it's incredibly disorientating. Like, for me as someone, I have awful hand-eye coordination. So this game does not go well for me. Like, this is worse than billiards for me. And that is coming from someone who just sat in billiards for an hour and didn't get any runs going. But I'm sure with practice it won't be that bad. It is a lot of hand-eye coordination. But I think with practice I can at least get a competent run. I won't go for world records in this game. Um, but yeah, basically, there is the sim there is a similar problem with this game that, um, okay, see, now we do need the, uh, the pointer. That's the only place you really need the pointer when the storm is on the screen. But as long as you're pointing on the screen, then you're fine. Like, there's nothing else really that matters with the pointer in this game. It's kind of forced, really. Um, you're great at hand-eye coordination, then that is very good. That is very good for this. Honestly, for the IL, I really should start on level 29. <laughs> because in Tita Targets, I do this little snake format with the menuing because of that game being down to the wire with the seconds. This game is very much not at that point for me. Um, nice. That was well controlled. That was good. Um, yeah, I think you just have to start with 1 and end on 30. So as long as I just do 1 and then do 29 to 2 and then do 30, then we're fine. Like, it would lose a little bit of time to menuing, but I really think that would be worth doing. I might sort my, uh, my split order after this run. Not that I'm going to run this ever again. See, like, there, what we can do is we can start, like, accelerating into a different place. Oh. Go back. Nice. We can start, like, accelerating into a different place. Um, or, like, at a different angle. Uh, and then sort of change where we're at. Like, we don't have to use the A or B to go up or down controls at all. But obviously it helps, but there's so many controls to this. There's like eight buttons to control it. Which you don't need all of them. Technically. This is a mega screwed. I'm just going to restart. <laughs> like, I'm not slowing down at all. 140% above average, yeah. I mean, my reaction time is good. It's just my hand-eye coordination is not good for this. Knowing strats would definitely be useful, though. Like, just avoiding things in general. Knowing how the cycles work and how, I, how comfortable I am with the cycles would be good. So just the mid... Like, 1 to 10 are fine, for the most part. See, like, look at this. Look at this. This is with me holding it straight. I have to hold it like this to get anything decent. And also, this gap is tiny considering the huge part we have on the ship. So, like, I definitely get hit here. So, we can go off course and then lose from that as well. So this is fine. So I'm, this, this is the thing. I just like to stick with... As long as I know I'm finishing, I just stick with it. Which is a bit slow. So now, there's another thing where if I hit these rainbow things, that's basically going to recenter my part. Which is good. And it also slows you down though, I think. Or some of these do. Never mind, that one did not. 
Actually, no, I remember where they slow you down. They slow you down where your ship is empty and you have to grab the part. I remember now. But, like, that one is not even really beneficial because, like, we have to go around this thing anyway. Whoa, slow down, slow down, go. No. Oh, and now I've got to sit through the cutscene. The thing bumped me up and then I tried to go down. It just wasn't having it. Dude, this is why the cy nine the cycles would be good. Right, let me try and go left. But like, I kind of need to go up. So, oh, and now, and now I've gone completely disorientated because, yeah, because I've tried to go up and it's gone down because of reverse controls. Yeah, honestly, I'm glad I get hit there. How does that not register? Thank you. I don't get how that one did and the other one didn't. Like, this is not the type of game where you can just pick up the game after a while and just know how to do it. Like, knowing the cycles is a huge part of it. Uh, we we're going way too... Yeah. That's fine. How? And I'm going... In the wrong direction. Nice. 19. Sub 10. So true. World record is 23 minutes. So, like, all I have to do for this is point. It looks a lot more complex than that, but it's not. I'm just going to tank this. Yep. A task of this will be very interesting. I don't think there is one. I assume there isn't. The games in motion are so much more complex than play. Because play, play lends itself to a task because it's mostly just pointer controls. So it's very, like, simple to task that. Oh, I'm the task. Oh, okay. It's news to me. We are crashing into both, apparently. We are stuck. Where's the part? Oh, it's like that. Oh, yeah, it's the smaller dots now, isn't it? I remember. As if we needed smaller dots to connect. We're going to do a single run of um, Tita targets after this, I think. Ah! Uh Okay, that's fine. That's okay. I did not realise they just weren't going to move for a very long time. That has not helped me. That did not help me in the slightest. This is not connecting. Oh. If you imagine, level 30 is this, but with four of these points. It's awful. It is beyond terrible. Terrible. 
I'll be happy to just finish a run of this, to be honest. None of this matters, because it's just going to be how long it takes me to do level 30. As I say, I've done level 30 like twice ever. And the first time, it took me like three minutes to navigate the level. And there's a five minute time limit on every level. So... Like, that's not helpful. That's not useful. <laughs> does it just randomly reassign it? Or does it actually put it in the middle? Because I'm not convinced. I'm not buying it. Look at this. Like, I had so long to react. And it's just terrible. Terrible positioning. Ugh. Ugh. I have to get carpal tunnel to get world record in this game. Ugh, please connect. Ugh. Like, it's so hard to just do a dead stop. No. And like, I can't, I can't just charge forward with that formation because of how the controls work. I have to do this to go back and then go forward and then try. Thank you. Ah, my splits are going to be broken because I do not have all of these levels. Only slightly broken, actually. Because after 26, we're going to unlock 27. Uh, yeah, so here we need the part. Which I can very conveniently just put in the middle. <laughs> kind of makes these first ones a little bit easier. Not much. To be fair, not much. But a little bit. Explain more. I guarantee you that will not help me. <laughs> I would love to be able to explain more what I'm doing, but this takes 100% of the brain for me to be able to even do this. So yeah, like here we can just charge up to this and then lose all our speed and it's fine. So like there's a vortex. We need to avoid that. That's going to try and suck me in. We don't need that. Nice. Ah. We have an issue. I can't do that. I can't skip the cutscene. Right, I need to bring... I need to do a save file for this game. I'm going to have to do 26 again in a minute. I need to do a save file for this game. Where I can do... IELs. And then one where I can do medals. Ah, I forgot. Just restart. It's quicker. It is 20. Yeah, but 20 was easier. Wait. No. Tw it didn't work on 20. <laughs> 20 took me ages. <laughs> it only worked when I was explaining because that was when I was also slowing down. Oh, come on. So the issue with this one is because it's on the side, it's like I'm having to do it at a dodgy angle anyway. Can we get the thing? I don't think we've had a slots win today. We might be having another stream where there's no first slots win. Okay, that is whack. But okay. I should probably have notes on my splits for which ones are like vortex alerts or something. That would be useful. Vor or not vortex alerts. Um, the storm alert. Okay, so from now on, 21 to 30, all the splits are in order. Because I messed up. 
well, not I messed up, but I wasn't going to do the first, the last five stages to have an optimal Star Shuttle run. I'll do this again at some point, so that this doesn't stay my PB. I mean, part of me just hopes that we royally mess up 30, so this doesn't stay my PB at all. Yeah, this, this, this level was giving off Storm Alert vibes. And we're going very low here. That's okay. Just go round. Just go round. Totally optimal path. Completely optimal. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh! How? Oh my goodness, they literally just went... Like, you can tell when they're connected when the dots are glowing. But the moment one was glowing, the other one just didn't. Oh, and the moment you get too close, it just stops wanting to connect. If this ever got into a marathon, I need a co-commentator. There is no way we're running this without one. Oh, come on! It's there. It's right there. Thank you. How did that work and not any of the others? Again. Okay, I'm completely screwed over. Yeah, I'm not going to submit this to any speedrun marathons, I don't think. Is this the one I just did? This is the one I just did, isn't it? Let me... Oh, I need to check now. Where am I at? I definitely did that one. Okay, I think we've done 23. Twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty. Yeah, we're on twenty-four. Yeah, it's a hundred and sixty percent payout, sixty percent chance. So you get ninety-six percent expected value, which is the sweet spot of like it's not worth it, but only just. Nice. Okay. We have to wait for cycles. This is the thing. So these are all the same dot. So that this one's fine. 25. And now, when I do 26 again, I need to not clear it. We're going to have to just sit through the cutscenes. Yep, grab the thing. Thank you. I'm not sure if you can uh, crash into the part too quickly. I assume you can because it still counts as... It is still an object you can hit. Uh, the thing's gonna... Never mind. No. Oh. Really? Nice. See, look, why does that count? Right, from now on, no exiting. Like that, the dots were small there. And the, I could definitely see, it was very clear, that that was... Um, the parts were getting, the arms were getting too far apart. And somehow it counted. Like, I don't understand how that one does. And the others were all completely out. So we're going to go really far out. 
Vortex pulls us in. Slow, 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 slow. I hit the thing, apparently, because the hitbox is ginormous. Okay, we're going right again, apparently. Oh, stop going too far over there. Uh, 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 there we go. Okay. We have to wait now. Now we get a taste of the cutscenes. Four left. Yeah, we have that 30 times in a Platz run. And also, the medal boundaries for this game are really interesting, uh, as in weird and stupid. Um, they are 10 for bronze, so 10 levels. And by the way, you get the medals as you're going through the level select. So medal marathon, if that was a thing in this game, would actually just get plat, because you also get bronze, silver, and gold on the way. Where's the vortex? Oh my god. I don't even know where the vortex is. Okay, we're past it, apparently. I could see the things being sucked in, but I didn't know where it was. That is not working yet, and it was on the wrong dots. Oh, no. This is going to be really bad now. Yeah. See, the thing is, you can even collide in weird ways on the dots as well. Like, that sent me flying over to the left. Which just makes it harder to align anyway for no reason. Thank you. No, oh, I did the thing. Gotta do it again. There's no way I don't PB this at some point. Okay, I know where the vortex is now. This just forces me to do more practice. This is not a bad thing. Yeah, if I can just speed over to that, that's at least something. Oh, uh, go past, go past. Okay, we can at least have a shot. Nice! Very good. Sub 20. Honestly, it looks like it, because, like, I'm really bad at this. Uh, I don't know how much Bender's actually optimised this. Oh, no. Okay, well, it's fine. Just think no one wants to, yeah. Wii Play Motion is a very unpopular game out of the Wii series. There are way more that have a lot more activity. I looked today, by the way, or yesterday, rather. 20 active runners of Wii Play. There are 20 at the moment. And a lot of that is carried by the fact that there's one person running Tanks Co-op who keeps running with a different person every time. Okay, apparently you can't collide into that and miss. Oh, and, and we're in the game. That's interesting. Uh, that is good knowledge. Good knowledge to have. Um, but also, that's a very hard one to grab with the fast speed. Ah! Uh, okay, I was trying to slow down. Listen. But yeah, uh, I don't know what exactly this run is at. But I feel like it can be uh, optimised. I mean, so can uh, Tita Targets. And Tita Targets is very optimised right now. And there's still a couple of minutes to save there. But it's the same thing as we play. With the nature of the game, it's it's one of those that just isn't going to have all of the time save. Like, ever. Uh, crash into me. Thank you. Okay, I'm trying my best to steady myself here. There we go. Okay. We'll just go really far out on the right. I'm going way too fast here. Way, way, way too fast for my liking. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, that was way... Uh, yeah, the dots are going way too fast here for me to have just fluked that. Yo, Theon might have just had our first slots win of the day. I do need to check that. But I think it is. Oh. See, that at least forces me to go slower. Because I'm in a natural position. I can't... I, I'm not at the stage where I can go fast enough to not be in a natural position and also go fast. So that was actually kind of helpful. No, I am just bad. I am just bad at this one. This is just skill issue. I'm happy to admit that. Like, this game is very fair. It's just the hitboxes are ginormous. So, it can seem quite unfair. But, yeah, this one is actually fair. So, I can't really complain. Also, there are two vortexes on this one. Get me out, get me out, get me out, get me out. Oh, see, look at that. I just hit a dot and I'm now off course. I hit one of the dots and that's what led me all the way over there. Like, that is kind of unfair. The fact that they have hitboxes. They should not have hitboxes like that. Not where you can be getting a really bad collision and going flying. I mean, technically speaking, if you're playing optimally, it doesn't matter anyway. But I am not playing optimally. So it just screws over people who are bad. Oh, come on. Nice. One more. Slots cost 100, but for every uh, finishing month of every season, so March, June, September, and December, uh, we have super slots, which is 500, but pays out a lot more. Uh, on average, it is a slightly lower return, but the only thing really that loses out is the super jackpot, because it's only doubled. But there is a higher chance of winning prizes, so generally speaking, it is you're better off on super slots. Oh. I gravitated towards it there. So super slots is only during the last month of the season. So this this season it will be December. I feel like I must be playing a lot faster than I was last time I did runs of We Play Motion because there's no way that I get to the end here in like 40 seconds. I don't know how this took me this long. I mean, clearly this end bit is just terrible. I would have laughed if I got that first try there, but yeah, that was terribly mis uh, misaligned. Yeah, so you have to be, like, in the middle for this one. Be in a good position and go. That's the only way, really. Yeah. This is what... 30 is like. No. That was just, yeah. I already said I can't go fast and realign it. I just can't do that. Nice. Solid clear. That's the only good thing about this run. 34-11 <laughs> or something. Or maybe 34-10. And we now have plat on this profile, and I really should keep this as a profile. All right, I don't think I can even do a teeter targets run because I don't have all the levels. I was wrong. I do have all the levels except 30. You know what? What we're going to do then is we're going to just do 29 and 30 just to show off how bad teeter targets is for runs. Or for plats anyway. But thanks for watching on YouTube. Socials in the description, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.